Henry Luce famously called the 20th century the American century. Listen to a quotation from another acute observer, Tony Soprano. It's good to be in something from the ground floor. I came too late for that, I know. But lately I'm getting the feeling that I came in at the end. The best is over. Is the best over for America? Or is there some chance that the 21st century will be a second American century? Well, Tony Soprano is also going to a psychiatrist. Nobody does that anymore. I mean, talk about, talk about the past. That's the most unreal thing about the... Uh, the uh, Sopranos? About, about the Sopranos. But give me the punchline. I mean, the, the question again... Well, what, the question is, 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 the 20, is there some prospect that the 21st century can be a second American century, or, has this kind of, or are we Britain at the end of the 19th century? Are we about think, to lose our dominance? I think we're on, we on the edge of about 800 more years of American centuries, frankly. Um, we, the biggest problem is all the people who see a problem. Um, it's very fashionable to see, uh, that, to think that the end is near. After the end of the 20th century, which was unquestionably the American century, American ascendancy and everything except thought, which was, we were still colonials of, of Europe. And, to the charming aristocracy. To, to the charming aristocracy, but in every other area, uh, we were supreme in a way that no country has ever been before. If you can just review the television specials uh, at the end of the century, and there were many of them that said, uh, well, this is a country that has brought great freedom to so many people, but we have people out there like Dr. Death um, who, wants to, uh, who, who wants to have uh, euthanasia uh, be legal. We have the problem of a f our militant uh, trainees on the far right in, in the, up in the Rockies. Um, everything was hedged uh, by these tremendous, uh, uh, these tremendous threats. I've covered neo-Nazi, uh, as a newspaper reporter, neo-Nazi demonstrations. You'll find nine poor benighted people watching around in a circle hoping for television cameras. Uh, in, in, but in, in actual fact, there's absolutely nothing to prevent uh, the next eight centuries, the next nine centuries. Uh, there's no reason why we shouldn't, uh, the, you know, after all, Rome had century after century, and there's no reason why we should have more. If uh, I don't, uh, maybe I should start giving uh, uh, moral advice, which is, be happy <laughs> with what you have. <laughs> Tom Wolf, thank you very much.